My name is Eugene Panrutkovich. I'm the laptop screen doc. The website is www.screensurgeons.com and today we're going to replace the screen on an HP DV6-1375 DX laptop computer. HP DV6-1375 DX laptop computer. So the screen is cracked on this one and we will replace it. The tools that you will need are tweezers, an electronics screwdriver with a PH0 bit and a larger PH1 bit, and an X-Acto knife blade. Okay, uh, this one it's relatively straightforward to replace the screen on. Um, there's only two screws that you have to remove from the front plastic frame and one is right here and one is right here. So um, there have some plastic covers so we take our exacto blade and remove the plastic covers first one and two and then we take our screwdriver and remove the two screws. This one is a bit tight, so but we can do it. One and first time you start turning it, push on it kind of hard so you don't strip it. I've had that happen to me before and then you have to use a stripped screw removing tool. You have to draw in it and use a special tool to remove the screw. So you don't want to get into that. Okay, uh, next thing we're going to snap the frame of, off. So for this laptop what I like to do is grab the side by the screen and with my fingers and gently start snapping it off. If you hear snapping sounds that's good. That means you're getting somewhere and slowly go around the whole laptop. Usually for a laptop like this, this is the trickiest part of the whole procedure. Okay, almost there and it's off. So we put that to the side. Okay, so next the screen is has is held by a plastic frame on the sides and there's two screws on each side one here and one here that you have to get to so and one here and one here to do that we need to tilt the screen forward a little bit and in order to do that we have to remove two screws at the top one and two okay and then we loosen the screws at the bottom let's go in for a close-up we'll loosen this one like this and this one like this whoever put this laptop together in China had some muscles because the screws on this laptop are extremely tight, tighter than usual. Okay, next, once we loosen the screws, we can tilt the screen forward like this and see if we can get to the screw on the side, which we can. We take this one out, one and two like so rotate the laptop on the other side and take two screws out on this side so we have one and Two. 
Now, this laptop has a LED screen, a 15.6 inch LED screen, so there's only one connector that you have to worry about. So we tilt the screen forward and you can see where the connector is down here. So next we loosen up the tape like this and take this one off like this. So we have to take the tape off the connector so we can snap it off. Once the tape is off, sometimes the connector cable has adhesive on the back. This one doesn't. So we're going to pull the connector off and voila, the screen is off. Okay, now this particular screen, it's a bit unusual. Usually for a 15.6 inch LED screen, the connector is not here. It's over here but for this one it's here. So if you replace the screen on this kind of laptop, make sure that you take the laptop apart and get the screen out before you order the screen so that you know where the connector is. Now uh, for, um, this lap for this screen, the part number is B156XW02 V0, version 0. It's made by AU, AU Optronics. So once again, the most important part when ordering the screen is to make sure the connector is on the right hand side when looking from the back. Uh, you can actually have the exact same part number, but the connector is going to be on the left hand side. So make sure it's somewhere it's specified that the connector is on the right hand side. So once you have the screen in, you just put it back in, put the connector in. Sometimes I like to put a little bit of scotch tape on top of the connector so it doesn't get loose and snap the cover back in and your laptop should be ready to go. And uh, that's it and good luck.